Okay, how are we doing out there? First things first, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Luminous 4K Screen Paint using Ambient Light Rejection Technology Game Times 2. Uh, we're showing off our Luminous Ambient Light Rejection. This is the Eclipse Cinema, the black screen paint. And now, you'll see some difference, some changes come along for the screen that I'm actually designing here. I'm still working on it. Now, before the bottom part right here used to be white, but I went out, got some uh, dark red paint, mixed it with a little black to get this kind of movie kind of style color at the bottom because I didn't want that to be white, I just wanted the trim that I have in my living room just to be white. Now the top area right here, there's gonna be a small little short curtain go from here, it's gonna match here and here. A nice little draped curtain across here. Um, I thought I could go to this curtain shop and buy something similar to it, but it didn't match. So I had to go back on Amazon, order the another set of the curtains, and then they're gonna be cut and trim to just match right across here to give a really, really cool kind of movie theater effect. So. I'll get it real close so you can see yeah, how I painted this in right here with a little frog tape and some time and some patience and it was done. All right, so first things first, as you see our screen is jet black. I'm going to take the projector off blank mode first. All right, there we go, projector off blank mode. Um, I'll hit my lights. Overhead lights, I might have to go a little farther because my remote control is dying over here. There we go. Got our overhead lights on so we have a nice and bright in the environment. Now my projector, I'll put the model number of the projector because I don't remember it offhand. But this is my new ViewSonic. This is a WU, uh, I think it's WUGXA projector uh, and 4000 lumens. And if you're curious to see it on other lumens, I've done this on several different forms of projector including Ultra Short Throw. I'll put those links at the bottom. You can check them out for yourself. Right there. So my projector sits back around 14 feet and 8 inches from the screen. In a fully lit environment, and we're gonna do a few demonstrations on the screen. Hope you enjoy them, and we'll just get this started, okay? All right. Now, as you can see on my screens, I always have condensed lighting in contact with the screen, plenty of light in the environment. Just show my customers that they don't have to be stuck in a dark environment just in order to enjoy their screens. I love this movie screen, I do. Now, the Eclipse it's now a roll-on screen paint before we had it with spray only. And you know, by making it a roll-on makes it very easy for our customers to be to use it in their everyday environment. You know what I mean? Some people will shy away from a paint sprayer uh, due to the fact that they don't want to be spraying it in their living room. And you know, um, like I said, we still make spray-on versions of it, but like I said, some people um, want to use this in their living room so they don't want to really go with a paint sprayer. And that's why we decided to make the Eclipse a roll-on. As you can see, picture quality is absolutely amazing. Keep in mind, my projector has never been calibrated. Uh, we're not using any form of 4K whatsoever. My projector is not 4K. It's higher than 1080p, but it's not 4K. And I can go anywhere I want in the environment, and my screen's going to pull up regardless. You can just see how bright the environment is. Consider the fact, like I said, a lot of my video demonstrations, how many times I've changed up my projectors, how many different screens I have painted, how many different, uh, how many areas my screens have been in different environments, and they all react the same way. Over here.
Look how the skin tones, everything just looks so amazing. For a jet black screen, the white levels are very high on this technology. As I said before, when we designed the Eclipse, we wanted to make sure the white levels were extremely high on a black screen. This screen alone has been getting me a lot of orders. And look at the white levels. White levels, keep in mind, the screen has the ability to produce both white levels and amazing contrast levels at the same time. That's one of the beautiful things about our technology. You do not have to be subjected to the dark. Like I said, a lot of people do not want to be sitting in a dark environment when it comes to their projection screen. They just don't. Now, can you imagine if I had all the lights out in this environment, it was pitch black dark. Let me show you, look at the condensed lighting hitting the fireplace over here. That's how much light has in contact with the screen. I did this yesterday, windows open, doors open. I'm just using everyday, the everyday lighting that I have in my environment that I use every day. You see right here and here, constant lighting, lighting, actually constant light hitting the screen at all times. Now keep in mind that the Eclipse screen paint, as you Eclipse Cinema uh, screen paint is still on sale. Will be on sale until the end of December. Around December the third is when the sale is going to end. Also put on the roll-on demonstration too. I did a demonstration where I actually rolled the screen on a smaller screen. And you'll get a chance to see how easy it is to apply this to just about anything you want. Any surface you want, you can apply this to. staircase really quick. Just show you from any angle. If I lean out from any angle, that screen is going to pick up. And I said before, many times if you're watching demonstrations, and those demonstrations are in the dark, the high points of that screen are in the dark, that's where you're going to be at. The only way you're going to be to achieve that picture from that particular demonstration is you're going to have to be in the same environment. And if you look at my environment, look around, it's nice and bright. At 14 feet 8 inches from the screen. I can go anywhere I want. I'm not going to sit there and take my camera and point to the dining room because, like I said, physical light in the dining room has nothing to do with my screen here. And as you can see, you can make out everything in my living room. You can see all the corners. Nothing's dark in this environment. Sorry about the squeaky floors. That constant condensed lighting is hitting my screen all the time.
right? So I'm gonna pop here in the living room, dining room real quick. Show you how busy my day has been. So, these are some of the orders going out today. We just sold to a huge church. They're gonna be happy with this. They already bought from us before. They are buying again. And they're doing, they're gonna do one big massive screen. And like I said, this right here is our Eclipse. This is the uh, Luminous Amulite Rejection Eclipse Cinema Paint with the AR technology game times two. So I got about another 60 of these to go between today and next week. And I got more orders coming in after that. But like I said, this is on sale for around, I think this is around four or three. I think it's around 400, around the price is around four something. But anyway, let me get on out of here. I got much to do, got a lot of work on my plate. Hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. Thank you all for your time. Um, the prices will be on the website. I'll put all that information at the bottom of the page. Thank you all for your time and 